And our Lita dad is in critical condition after a brutal hit and run crash. The driver of a stolen van ran a red light and smashed into his Toyota, leaving him with very serious injuries. Tonight, his sister is speaking to KCAL 9's Lauren Posen. And Lauren joins us live at the hospital where he's being treated in Mission Hills. Good evening, Lauren. Good evening, Pat. And you know, these injuries were so serious that first responders actually had to use the jaws of life to free this father of three from his car. He's undergone multiple surgeries here, and his family tells me he has a very long road of recovery ahead of him. And they want the people responsible for putting him here held accountable. We need to find them. We really, really need to find them. A sister's plea for justice. When Christy DiOrio's older brother Christian called her last Sunday, she says her heart sank. All he kept saying is, take care of the kids too. I like, I'm like, I got you, don't worry about it. You know what I mean? Like, like, but what kind of accident? Where are you? Where are you? Los Angeles police say at 1:15 Sunday morning, a suspect driving a stolen U-Haul van on Osborne Street ran through a red light at Beachy Avenue in Arlita and crashed into Christian's car. And he was pushed like 50 to 100 feet down the street. In the surveillance video from LAPD, you can see the impact. Police say the driver of the U-Haul and the passenger took off running, leaving Christian trapped. If none of the neighbors came up, came out, my brother would, would be gone. And that's, that's not fair for us. As Christian recovers in the hospital from multiple surgeries to heal fractures from his ribs down, he couldn't be at his oldest daughter's once in a lifetime moment. Graduating from high school. He's been emotional regarding it because he can't be there. Dioro says she will not rest until the suspects are found. He's a gentle giant. My brother was every, like, we're the closest family. How can you do this? You know, we should, it's it's not. It's I, I'm so mad, but I don't know what to say. And Dioro tells me that her brother is also the caretaker of their mother. If you have any information that can help police track down these suspects, give them a call. Reporting live in Mission Hills, Lauren Posen, KCAL 9 News. Lauren, thank you.